Hello boys and girls, Mrs. Warner here. Today I'm going to be reading After the Fall. It's the story of how Humpty Dumpty got back up again. There's Humpty Dumpty, he's on the wall. Um, this book was written by Caldecott Medal winner Dan Santat, and it's one of my favorites. After the Fall. My name is Humpty Dumpty. This was my favorite spot, high up on the wall. I know it's an odd place for an egg to be, but I loved being close to the birds. Then one day I fell. I'm sort of famous for that part. Folks called it the Great Fall which sounds a little grand. It was just an accident, but it changed my life. Kings County Hospital. Fortunately, all the King's men managed to put me back together. Well, most of me. There were some parts that couldn't be healed with bandages and glue. Look, there's Humpty's bed, and this is where he's sleeping. I wonder why he's sleeping on the floor. After that day, I became afraid of height. I was so scared that it kept me from enjoying some of my favorite things. If you look at the picture, you'll see that all of the fun cereals are on the top shelf. I walked past the wall every day. I would think about climbing that ladder again. I really missed the birds and being high above the city, but I could never do it because I knew that accidents can happen. I eventually settled for watching the birds from the ground. It wasn't the same, but it was better than nothing. Then one day, an idea flew by. Making planes was harder than I thought. It was easy to get cuts and scratches, but day after day, I kept trying and trying. until I got it just right. My plane was perfect and it flew like nothing could stop it. I hadn't felt that happy in a long time. It wasn't the same as being up in the sky with the birds, but it was close enough. Unfortunately, accidents happen. They always do. There's Humpty looking up at the wall. There's his paper airplane. I almost walked away again. But then I thought about all the time I spent working on my plane and all the other things I'd missed. I decided I was going to climb that wall. But the higher I got, the more nervous I felt. I didn't want to admit it. I was terrified. I didn't look up. I didn't look down. I just kept climbing one step at a time until I 
was no longer afraid. Maybe now you won't think of me as that egg who was famous for falling. Hopefully you'll remember me as the egg who got back up. Something's happening. Crack. Crack. Remember Humpty is an egg. Hopefully you'll remember me as the egg who got back up. and learned to fly. The end. Thank you for listening to my story today. I hope that you learned a lesson from this book and that you can share that with your family at home. Thank you.